How's it going everyone? JKCX here back on Forza Horizon 3 today. And you can already tell what I'm in. I'm in the new Ferrari 599XX released earlier. Earlier today. It's only a 24 hour Forzathon as you can see. So if you want this car, you best go ahead and start some of the races that you need to do. Because by the looks of it, and from my first feels of it, it's really good. Three races, we'll pick random different ones in different locations. I think we'll start it off with a sprint now. We'll start the championship here and then we'll add two races to it that should also be able to show me the Ferrari's performance. So let's get this started. Championship. Blueprint a championship. I think we should go against some other track toys so we can really get a feel for this car. And we want to ch change the route. Right, let's remove what we currently have. We don't want an off-road race of any sorts. Right, we'll do this race as well, it's another sprint race and it looks like a very bendy one, so this one will give us a feel for the handling as well. 16.3 miles, three events, let's get this started. Here we go, first race, we're against some, quite, some other interesting cars there. Lots of hurricanes by the looks of it, but straight into it, Ooh, we're starting at the front for some reason. A lot of wheel spin off the line, but it's also got a lot of speed. We should be able to take this flat out. Get out of the way, Aston Martins. Move, yes, right, looking good so far. Break heavily for that corner. Leaving them for dust, sort of. Should be able to take all of these full throttle. This is wicked. Full throttle around every corner. Not going to break much for this one. Should have broke a little bit more though. Yeah, there's always that one driver tar that can slingshot. Not a problem. We are in first place. Full throttle around here. Don't need to break. Full throttle around there. Yes. Oh, I can see the Hurricane's lights behind us. Stay back. Stay back. The finish line is in sight. Let off the throttle around that corner. Let off the throttle around this corner. Full throttle through this one. Yeah, if you know how to use this car, it's turning out rather good. I have to break for that one, of course. It's quite a tight corner there. One last straight to the finish. Easy peasy. I like this. <laughs> I like this a lot. It most definitely is a track toy like it says it is. Oh, we're close to levelling up. Nearly level 559. Nearly. Right, what shall we do next? Let's do the lapped race next because it was a sprint one we just did. Next one's a lapped one. And then I also have a little idea. We're going to do the first two races um, stock because that's what we are now. We did the first one stock. We're going to do this one stock. And then for the last sprint race, I'm going to upgrade it to all wheel drive and the max horsepower we can find. Hopefully around 1200 horsepower, all wheel drive. That should be crazy fast. But here we go, the lapped race now. Ooh, a lot of wheel spin off the line, not a problem. Goodness me. You can't really take that corner much quicker than I just did there. Come on, power. It's got the handling, but it's not got as much power as these guys here by the looks of it. I'm keeping up though. Definitely catching up by the looks of it. Come on. Come here. Should be able to go full throttle through this bit here. Unlike these idiots. Get out of the way. Yes. Come here, Lotus. That is a Lotus, isn't it? I can't tell. I'm probably wrong knowing me keep the power keep the power don't break much for the corners get out of the way hurricane whoa that was a big drift i'm gonna need to rewind that that's just completely ruined it come here he is a little bit quicker than us not much just a little bit Can we overtake him here, please? 
yes, yes, first place, there we go. We just need to hold first place now for half a lap. That was a bad gear change there. One corner. Now, if I'm going to lose, this is where I'm going to lose because they have a bit more power than me. But they are too far back to lose. But they're too far back. There we go. It's starting to show how good this car is now. Even though it's not as quick as other cars, it can still win because of its handling, because of its high speed handling and high speed braking, it's turning out to be rather good. Should have leveled up there. Yes, right, what are we gonna get? Aston Martin V12. Not too impressive. Yeah, well, it could be worse, I suppose. But it's time to see if it's even better. Fully upgraded and all wheel drive. Straight to upgrades now, conversion, all wheel drive. Hope I don't regret doing that. Twin turbo. This is gonna be crazy. There we go. How much horsepower? 1,160 horsepower. It's a little bit heavier, but that's because we changed the drivetrain. Right, here we are. Straight to start race, I guess. We don't need to change anything. Oh, look at that launch. We've left them for dust. Slide around the corner. Yep, I can already tell a decrease in the handling's performance. But the speed is phenomenal. I mean, the handling isn't too bad, I suppose. It can still take corners at 100 miles an hour, at the least. Not as quick as it could when it was rear-wheel drive, that's for sure. We're just left with me and this other guy in front now. <laughs> oh, should have broke more for that. Hurricane is right behind us. Now, I think the reason I'm winning very easily now, although it is on the top difficulty, is because the because I have it on a set car class, I have it on extreme extreme track toys. I don't think any of the other track toys can actually get up to this the power of this 1,200 horsepower. So even though they're upgraded, they're still not to my level. Which is one of the reasons I'm not having troubles keeping first place. I'm not even trying. But full throttle round there. It says it isn't actually too bad. I was expecting that to completely ruin the handling. But that turned out pretty good. Now, while I'm here, I can see a driver tar on the map. Let's go and give this guy a shot. What's he in? Ultima GTR. Nothing compared to my Ferrari. Although I say that as he is pretty quick. I'm just going to beeline it. I'm going to take him with me as well. Come on, lad. <laughs> what the? Hit a tree. Go on, hit a tree. No. I'm stuck. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Ah, you're stuck. Oh, look at him. <laughs> Poor lad. Huh. Well, okay then. It was an interesting little race, uh, 53,000 credits though. You do get a lot of credits for those races and I don't really understand why. They're not necessarily hard. Oh well, my overall thoughts on this car, definitely very good, definitely worth getting. It is worth using in the races because I believe it does outdo all the other track toys that are in the same car class. It's good stock, good rear wheel drive, it does wheel spin a little off the line. But overall, it's really good. Even upgraded, all-wheel drive, max horsepower, which turned out to be just under 1,200. It's also very good. Anyway, everyone, thank you very much for watching. I hope you all have enjoyed. One other thing I'll say once again, the winners of the giveaway have been announced. I uploaded the video earlier today, so if you have not seen that video and you are entered the giveaway, give it a look because you might have won. But there's definitely going to be some more giveaways in the future anyway, probably very soon. But yeah, leave a like if you've enjoyed everyone, I hope you have. Subscribe for more Forza content, and I'll see you all later.